Hey there, lifestyle property people. A really important question to ask yourself when you're choosing a buy to let uh, opportunity is whether to get a interest only mortgage or a repayment mortgage. Uh, so first of all, let me explain the terms. So an interest only mortgage is a mortgage where every, your monthly payments are just paying the interest on that mortgage. And so what that means is at the end of the term, you still need to pay the capital. You still need to pay the entire mortgage back through an investment vehicle. And whether that is through a pension or the sale of a house uh, or inheritance or something like that, you still need to pay that uh, money back. A repayment mortgage is slightly different. And where that is where on a monthly basis, the amount that you pay goes towards actually paying off the interest, but also some of the uh, capital. And what that ultimately means is at the end of the term, you'll have paid off the entire mortgage and you'll own the property. So that's what the difference between interest only and a repayment mortgage is. Ultimately, the uh, the advantage of an interest only mortgage is that because you're paying less uh, interest on a monthly basis, because you're not paying the capital part of uh, the payment, your uh, cash flow or your net profit on a yearly basis is going to be a bit higher. And if your net profit is going to be a bit higher, you can then put that in the bank and decide what to do with it. One of those things that you can do with it is make overpayments to your mortgage. So what interest only gives you is the opportunity and the option to repay the mortgage. With a repayment mortgage, it's slightly different. With a repayment mortgage, because you're paying it down every single month, uh, you don't have the option of uh, paying it off, you have to pay it off. But the advantage with the repayment mortgage is that over time, because the house is getting paid off, the amount that you owe reduces, and as a result, it's a, a potentially slightly safer investment. It's a slightly uh, less risky way of doing it because you know that at the end of the term, you're going to have paid off the entire amount. So that's the difference between a interest only mortgage and a repayment mortgage. The next thing to then tackle is, well, which one of these is right for you? Ultimately, it comes down to your individual circumstance and it's best to consult an uh, individual uh, mortgage uh, professional. Um, However, with interest rates being as low as they currently are, and with the expectation that they're going to become negative in the future, in the near future, it may well be a good opportunity to leverage the money from the bank and purchase uh, buy-to-let properties, and purchase more buy-to-let properties. And so an interest-only mortgage may well be the way forward for you. As I said earlier, it's useful to consult an independent mortgage professional and if you need any recommendations, please uh, comment below and I will tag some people in. Lovely speaking to you. See you soon. Bye.